Hey everyone, today I'm back with my mother Susan. Hi everyone, how are ya? And we have a special treat. Today we're making my mother's warm Italian pasta salad. And let me tell you guys, it is the best pasta salad I've ever had. Certainly not anything that you can buy in a store. And when you break this out at someone's barbecue, they're gonna love you for it. And the first thing we're gonna do is me and my mother, we're gonna take a trip out to her garden. We're gonna cut ourselves a little fresh basilico. All right, so we're gonna chop a little bit of this fresh basilico and we'll start getting it down here. Nice. Wow, my, you got a lot of basil. Yeah, a lot of basil. Yeah, nice, fresh. Oh, I love that smell. Oh, it's beautiful. Uh, let's All see. Right. Yeah, we need a little bit more. I'll okay. spend a little bit more. Dang. One more. One more, okay. One more nice big one. All right. Nice. All right, we got our okay. basil. Okay, good. And back we go. All right, everybody, here we are, all right? And there's a lot of ingredients. I'm gonna start on that side. That's a half a cup of Parmigiano grated. That's a pint and a half of assorted cherry and grape tomatoes. That's eight ounces of pearl mozzarella, fresh mozzarella balls. That is a bag of frozen peas, all right? Just to frost it in some warm water and drain room temperature. A can of medium-sized black olives. This is a cup and a half of a shredded mixture of Asiago, Romano, and Parmigiano. That's good stuff, all right? Then, our fresh basil. Ma, I don't know, what do you think? Cup, uh, cup and a half, two yeah, cups. I don't yeah. know, there's a lot of basil. Basil's really to taste, but you can see we got a good amount. Okay, we got our fafali and our dipping oil. Now, you can come out with your oregano and your dry basil and your rosemary and your olive oil and you can mix it all up or you can buy a bottle of Italian dipping oil and you basically just use this. This, this is your seasoning for the whole thing. One bottle, good to go. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to get my pasta in the water and I'm going to start to cut up everything you see here. We'll be back. All right, everyone. Well, my mother is back there tending to the pasta. I'm ribbon and basil. And the way you ribbon basil is you take your biggest leaves, start at the bottom, right? And as you get closer, stack up some smaller ones. And I get about I don't know, five or six on there, and then you give them a nice tight roll. All right? And then you come in with your knife. All right? Nice. And there you go. Look at that. Beautiful. So, I have to ribbon all this basil, my mother said. So I'm going to do that, she's going to tend to the pasta, and when we come back, I'll be cutting everything else up, and then we'll be mixing our warm pasta salad. All right, guys, and now I'm uh, halving the medium-sized black olives after a, a good five minutes of ribbon basiling. My mother joined in, and as you can see, I got most of it on this side in the mixing bowl, but I do have a little bit right here. This, that's going to be added at the very end. So that's going to be part of the mix. That goes in at the very end. All right? And away we go. Hi, everybody. Uh, well, I have Kenny uh, draining the macaroni with the scola macarona. Um, I am chopping in half these little small uh, fresh mozzarella balls to add to our pasta salad. And then we're going to be able to mix everything together once we chop all those nice eggs. Get out of there. Yeah. Um, we're going to chop up the tomatoes, take some of the seeds out, and then when we come back, we're going to mix everything together. We'll be back. We'll be right back, guys. All right. And as you can see, what I'm doing is 
I'm kind of separating the seeds as I'm cutting the tomatoes. I got my, I'm, I'm cutting them in quarters, got my pile there, and I got, of course, my pile of seeds right there. You know, so you give it a half, you give it a half, and there's your seeds, and there's your cut tomatoes. Nice. So, I'm almost ready. All right, as soon as I'm done, my mother's got the macaroni, and we'll be back. All right, guys, here we are. My mother, she's taking over, just so you know. I said, Ma, we got to mix it in the glass bowl. She said, no. I go, but Ma, people want to see. She says, no. She goes, we got to mix it in the pan. It goes all over the place if you try to mix it in the So, mm -hmm. there'll be no bowl mixing of the, of the pasta When salad. we're finished with all the mixing here, then we put it in the bowl. Okay. okay, so there you go. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to hit it with the entire bottle of this Italian dressing. Of course, I said dressing, but it's not dressing. It's, it's dipping oil. You know, and it's got all the good stuff. Oregano, rosemary, basil, parsley, chili flake. Garlic powder, everything in it. It's but delicious. It, but instead of having to go get all those ingredients to mix in, one bottle does it all. And you can. You can do your own. You can put a little garlic olive oil. You can put a little basil olive oil. Now, Kenny, give me that shredded cheese. All right. Asiago Romano Parmigiano. So it'll now that'll melt in. Nice. Ooh, smell that. That's delicious. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nice. You want the you want the grated. Now I'll take the grated. Yeah, I'll give you a little grated. Ready? Yep. Perfect. Nice. Because okay. of course the pasta, it's still warm. So the cheese, it's melting in right now. Yeah. That's why we start with those. Now can you get a couple of foot gases and let's try it and see if it's got enough dressing and whatnot. Now I will tell you, when you're done with this, you can add a little bit more olive oil at the end. You can put a little bit more cheese to your liking. I usually will add a little bit more olive oil at the end, but let's taste and see how this is tasting right now. Oops, sir. Mm. Mm. Delicious. But nothing else. But it's delicious. Okay, now we're gonna okay. do our tomatoes. Take that. Yep. And do our cheese. Sweet. Take one for me. Ah. Oh. No. Cheese. Zelly. Love peas. Olives. And that's the and big the one. There you go. And I have become a dishwasher. There you go. Just like that. You got a little, little dip of this left. Yeah. Yeah, and I may end up putting a little bit more olive oil in too. Actually, I have a little gonna, thing of. I'm gonna get you the tin man. I uh, and yeah, and I also have a little thing there, Kenny, of some um, garlic. You guys, oil. Remember, guys, remember the tin man? I told right. you it's right by the stove. Right. Right. Here's the tin man. Tell me when. Right, that's good. Eight. Hey. Good. Okay. Perfect. We'll leave the tin man out. And what do you want? The garlic oil. A little too? bit of the garlic olive oil. Okay. Like I said, this right. is to taste. Little extra virgin thing. garlic oil. Yeah. Good. All right. Okay. Just for the flavor. All right. Just for the flavor. Uh -huh. All right. And now, don't forget we get salt and pepper here. Yeah. Well, let's see what we need. Uh -huh. Mix this in. We need two more forgetters. Can we go with this? No. We need two more clean forgetters. Get the forgetters. Sorry. Okay. There you go. There you go. Good. All right. Mm. Delicious. I don't think it needs anything. Because I think all the spice from the oil is in here. You like it That's really good. good. Guys, you're going to love this pasta sauce. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Now we can pour it in the bowl. Okay, so we're going to clean all this up, and when we come back, we'll give you that final product that you're going to want to take for your next barbecue. All right, everybody, here we are, and let's see what we have.
ready, Ma? No, oh, I'm ready. Nice. Oh, good, good, good. Ready? Okay. Me, I need to. So. All right. Let's see. Gonna get a little bit of everything. Mm. Guys, this is my favorite. This is gonna wow people at that barbecue. When you walk in with this pasta salad, and people start getting a bowl. It's delicious. Mm. My grandmother would say, magnifico. Wow, that's mm. fantastic. I hope everyone enjoyed this. I certainly hope you tried this warm pasta salad because you are gonna love it. If you liked it, please click that thumbs up. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. And until next time, live, laugh, and cook Italian.